The JWL technical standards are set by the Japanese government to ensure the safety of aluminum road wheels. Rays has established an even stricter in-house standard called Plus R. Rays is a wheel supplier with the latest knowledge of the most advanced vehicles thanks to its technologies and experiences obtained from motorsports. Brakes have grown in size due to increasingly powerful engines, which in turn has led to a growth in the weight of vehicles. It is necessary that wheels also adapt to this trend. However, as the outer diameter of wheels gets larger, the sidewalls of the tires become thinner. When vehicles travel, their wheels can impact with objects from road surfaces. Stronger and more resistant, JWL Plus R is a safety standard to deal with the ongoing evolution of vehicles. RAISE specifies multiple standard values, spec 1 and 2, which correspond to the characteristics of cast and forged aluminum wheels. Ensuring the wheels safety so that they can endure long periods of driving. In a radial load endurance test, loads are applied using standard methods. Wheels are rotated to plus R standard values, assuming high speed and performance driving. Then the wheels are checked for deformities and loose nuts. Safety to deal with the horizontal force of the direction of travel. The rotating bending fatigue test checks the endurance of disc parts. Wheels are rotated to plus R standard values by applying bending strength. Then the wheels are checked for deformities and loose nuts. Safety to deal with impact from road surfaces and curves. The 13 degree impact test checks air retention and the strength of rims, discs and joints. Employing a prescribed method, plus our standard weights are dropped so that they cause impacts. Then the wheels are checked for cracks, deformities and air leakage. These tests are all carried out by test facilities belonging to RAISE and approved by the Vehicle Inspection Association. Then, there is safety for accidents. We carry out RAISE exclusive strength tests, which aren't specified by JWL, with the aim that vehicles can continue traveling even after crashes. In the 90 degree impact test, a one ton weight is applied perpendicular to a rim in an action equivalent to collisions with road obstructions or crash impacts. A radial load endurance test is performed after the wheels alter deformation shape in accordance with established values. These safety standards are aimed at allowing drivers to continue driving safely even after collisions. Varied coating performance tests replicate driving conditions in various natural environments. Rigidity analysis use computers to simulate varied driving conditions. Wheel problems caused by design defects are corrected at the planning phase to satisfy JWL plus R standards. These strength tests were established after obtaining a wide range of data based on race racing and market experiences. Specs that are practical and real, that is JWL plus R. They are proof of the reliability of race wheels and the rule they use when making their products. Forged aluminum wheels reflecting the integration of Ray's varied technologies.
This is a process involving the highest specifications and satisfying the JWL Plus R strength standard. The process underscores market demands for weight reduction. Rays collected a large amount of data while it developed its aluminum wheels. Eventually, it discovered the superior properties of aluminum alloy 6000. The wheels have high ductility and toughness, which are qualities peculiar to aluminum. Rays conducted extensive engineering development to achieve these properties in its wheels. As a result, it managed to produce ultralight aluminum wheels through forging. Forging is a process that enhances the original strength of raw materials. The strength and property of aluminum alloys depends on their elementary crystal size and density. As density increases, so does strength. However, hard aluminum is sometimes vulnerable in collisions. During forging, thousands of tons are applied to the aluminum alloys to pressurize them and alter their shape. A point-like metal structure is formed into a line called a metal flow. The metal flow offers the ductility of a spring and provides a repulsive force against impacts. However, the manufacture of forged wheels is technically difficult and development costs are high. Rays offers technical advantages and improved productivity thanks to its RM forging process, which the company developed independently. In this process, disc surface finish forging and rim spin forming are performed at the same time. This produces high quality metal flows that are seamlessly arranged from the disc to the entire rim, significantly improving the wheel's strength. Furthermore, this process reduces costs through efficient production and makes possible a stable supply of high quality forged aluminum wheels. The passion for making things combined with high technology in the engineering department, professionals in various fields engage in the repeated process of trial and error. New models that reflect the needs of the market are studied and discussed. Rays, a trendsetter, develops a wide range of products reflecting the needs of the market and based on information developed from auto racing businesses and sales networks. Victory can depend on such a slim margin as one hundredth of a second. Rays supports the tuning category corresponding to racing, in which light and tough wheels are required. This extends from the entry class, for Sunday drivers, to the drift, where the D1 Grand Prix is at the pinnacle of this field. There's the sophisticated dress-up category, which pursues the latest trends and designs of European taste. There is also the sport compact category, based on the U.S. market, and the import category, corresponding to world brands. We conduct various activities to satisfy the varied needs of our customers. Rays deals with requests pertaining to specific car models, in cooperation with Works Tuners. We are a comprehensive wheel maker, which designs and develops our products. Rays has the marketing power to determine clients' needs from examining information and the technical capabilities of JWL plus R. Manpower and an integrated system of hardware and software are at the heart of Rays. It is from that base that Rays wheels provide reliability and satisfaction to their users. This is the manufacturing line of the forged aluminum wheels.
forging is a process to form metal lines with volume distribution corresponding to a design shape on the billet of aluminum alloy. The forging of wheels starts with this kind of hot forging. RM forging, a method developed exclusively by rays, is a process to spin a uniform structure with fine metal flows, formed by hot forging. The finishing of design parts is accomplished at the same time. An RM forged rim is thinly formed by cold spinning. A high-speed spinning machine can form rims of varied widths. This is solution heat treatment. Aluminum alloy is rapidly heated and melted with ultra-high-speed heating type thermal treatment equipment. Then the alloy is cooled down immediately and fixed to form a strong structure. Then age hardening improves the elongations and toughness of the aluminum. The aluminum alloy is carefully forged at low temperatures for long periods of time. A hardness testing machine determines whether these heat treatments have satisfied the specific standards. An NC cutting device with an accuracy of one hundredth of a millimeter is used in the machining process to improve the accuracy of the roundness. Then flashes are carefully removed after the bolt pattern machining process. During an alignment test after processing, the wheel's roundness is carefully checked with an indicator balancer. In addition, invisible scratches are checked with a computer in an eddy current testing to avoid cracks in materials. The JWL plus R standards are fulfilled through exacting tests during the manufacturing phase. After processing, the surface strength of edges is increased and shot blasting is performed to smooth surfaces. Finishing surface treatments, chromate films are first applied on the surface to protect the aluminum from corrosion. Fine coating materials with a diameter of 100 microns are blow coated to improve smoothness. Then the wheels are spray coated. Wheels are colored in line with their designs or clear coated to protect their surfaces. Wheels may be alumite treated to improve their metallic luster.